right. Let's get it going. I played this game before on stream. This is Lightning Force for Sega Genesis. It's a really good game. I've been wanting to play this again since uh, since the last time I streamed it. Um, I just really enjoy it. It's a really. It might be one of my favorite uh, Sega Genesis games. Genesis does what Nintendo don't. So is this game an RPG or a shoot 'em up? It's a shooter. It is a like a Gradius, um, you know, type of thing, R type type of thing. Is this Thunder Force? Yeah, well, Thunder for Force Four. I could also put that in the description. Thunder Force Four, Lightning Force, Thunder Force. I'll do like AKA, AKA. Thunder Force. Oh jeez, what did I do? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm putting this in the... That's the longest description of a stream, but I'll do it. I'll do it. Boom. Alright. Various forces, basically. Look, already, like, look how this game, like, looks. <laughs> all right. It's awesome. So, all right, let's get this going. With this on the uh, D-pad, you can basically select the level. So right now, like, whatever one I wanted to do first, I could do. So basically, if I hit down, I would do rune. If I hit, uh, I don't know, uh... Right, I would hit. I would do Dazer. I guess select uh, Air Raid, and up would be the top one. So basically, you can select what levels. Um, it's a little weird because you hit like the direction on the D-pad to select the levels. But uh, thanks, Mariko One, for subbing with Twitch Prime. Mazo85 says, "I'm no good at these shooters. Makes my head spin." Yeah, um, I, I really like them, but. You know, shooters are probably, honestly, the hardest type of games out there for the most part. <laughs> a good, good example was what just happened right there. I s slammed into the wall immediately. Thanks, uh, Jermario86 for subbing. Appreciate that. So I'm hoping to do another stream later tonight. Um, I got a 3DS capture card, finally. I'm just trying to set it up, but, um, crap. But once I get it set up, hopefully we can do some 3DS games. So I have that in the works. D DS and 3DS and all that shit. Fuck. First of all, I'm going to get used to this again. So we can switch between shots with... I'm switching between power level and then... Oh yeah, back shot. Okay, that. Yeah, see, I'm trying to remember how to even play this. So also, slow down. Hey, I thought Genesis was supposed to be... Blast processing and shit, right? Or all that. Not so much. See, they say, like, oh... Super Nintendo with R-Type with the with the slowdown. Yeah, but look at this. Shit. See, and then it goes from slowdown to fast. That's not good, because that's jarring. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Let's start that over. Uh, Sniggle Twitch, it's um, 3DS capture card that I got. I could show you guys. Where did I put that? Maybe, maybe a little while, I'll show it to you. Um, no, I don't want to continue. I just want to Oh, it is continuing. See, I don't know if it's infinite continues or what. Thanks, Adam Messenger. Looking forward to me doing Star Trek on Game Boy. I will, I will. It's blast processing. You're pulling so much energy that you formed a speed bubble dilating time itself around you. See, that's exactly correct. That's what it looks like is going on. 3DS. For the first 3DS game should be Link Between Worlds. It's, it's a Link to the Past clone. Oh, I, I played it and beaten it, um, Silver. Um, 
The only thing about that would be kind of long, um, but I, you know, but yeah, I might do that. I could do, I could do Link Between Worlds eventually. I was looking for my copy of uh, Contra Four, but I couldn't find it, so I think another copy of it now. Okay, now I can, okay, see back shot. I can switch between those. But yeah, I'm hoping to do a whole bunch of DS and 3DS streams coming up now that I finally have that. I've been wanting to do it for a while. As if I don't have enough things to stream. Ooh, what's that? Just points? I'm gonna mess this dude up. Fuck you, buddy. I can, I can do the back shot too if anything's behind me. Hunter. What's that? Hunter? Ooh. Oh, yeah, I remember that. I just remember enjoying this game so much when I streamed it the first time. I didn't beat it or anything. I don't know how, how far I actually made it in this. Probably, uh, I, I think I made it like a little bit of a distance, but I, I didn't beat it. So that's why I'm doing this again today. Not that I think I'm gonna beat it today, just that I like the game. Oh, his back shot, front shot, hunter, all this shit. Oh my god. Should I do this? I don't even know. The good thing about this is it's kind of heat seeking. It ERs hunting. I wonder if I said that on the last stream of this game. I probably did. Because I tend to say the same things over and over and over. Some days you just can't get rid of a bomb. Boom. You know what I do remember? I could not figure out the. It, okay, it's just, you know what? It is just the middle face thing. It's when it opens up, it's the only time you can hit it, like, there, and then get away, and then he does his little lightsaber thing, like, that's right there. It's like, you know what I should be doing? I should do the back shot on him, right? Like that? Yeah. All right, I'm going to get this all down eventually, I promise. They, there you go. They want you to do shit, something like that, I think. Sam learning. I'm learning. It looks like the thing from boxing on Atari. When they, they go to punch it. Fuck, damn, this is tough. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, so I want to completely start over here. Get him in the back and in the front. <laughs> that's a that's a good advice as well. That's a good advice as well. Jesus Christ, no, I'm not having it. You know what else I'm not having? The fact that my Genesis is so fucking far away from me. My NES is closer. I hate, I hate, I hate it. But you know what though? If I get good at the game, I won't have to hit the reset button, right? Technosoft. What well, like? Good games that Technosoft make. Shout them out to me, chat. Let's 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 read that. Thanks, Poison Mushroom. Boom. Ooh, snake. I don't. I haven't seen that weapon before in this. I don't remember that on the last year, so back shot snake. 
fuck. And fuck. And uh, so you lose your you lose your weapon based on what weapon is on right now. So if I like died right now, I would lose the back shot. That's just, oh, there we go. That's what I need. Is he dead already? No, he's not. For some reason, I thought I was gonna get lucky. Now he's dead. Oh, no, come on, see that? I don't, that, he, they spawned it on top of me, come on. What? I didn't even see what the hell hit me there. Jesus. No, well, nobody said this was gonna be easy, but the spawning on top of me was like, come on. All right, let's, oh yeah, Hunter. Hunter! Mm, I don't like those things appearing. I don't like it, I don't like it. Oh my God. I keep getting killed by things just like appearing underneath me. I'm gonna have to get lucky to have that not happen. Um, also, if I do that, I see, see in the top side there, you can actually make your, I guess, power goes, power go up? I actually don't really understand that yet. Um, if anybody knows what to deal with that, I, I guess, like, what I'm trying to say is, like, you can, I guess that's my power level and you can make it go up, but, like, I don't see what, I don't see what I'm losing, because if you hit one thing, you just die no matter what anyway, so why would I not keep my power up? If anybody understands that mechanism, please let me know. Actually, you know what? I think I might have the manual. It's going to be one of those rare cases where I break out the manual and try to figure out what that's about. Let's see if I can figure it out in the manual. Let's see if I can look at the hood. Ships left. Pow okay, power monitor. That's... I knew that much. Power monitor. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Tell me about the power monitor, though. A lot of information on all the stages, game over. I mean, so basically I'm looking on, I'm looking for a part that tells me about the power monitor, but it look, it, I don't see anything on here that, oh wait, maybe it is. Um, Engine power, 50%, uh, 75%, or 100%. This is this only the setting is for the, only for the start of the game. You can change the engine's power during the game as well. Okay, so you can change the engine's power. So I guess that's not the weapon's power. That's the engine's power. Okay, this power is speed. It has nothing to do with the weapons. Okay, so. Yes, now I see that. Okay, it is your speed. All right. So unlike, uh, so that's where I was confused. I thought power meant like how strong my weapons were. All right. Oh, look, and there are credits. So if I don't make it far in the beginning, I definitely want to be resetting. Okay. Now I'm getting this down. Oh my God. You know what? The whole last time I played this game, the last stream, I didn't even know about the speed thing. Now I know. What's up, Ikaruga Silver Gun? All right. You know what? Let's not do that stage first. Let's try. Let's try that. 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 I don't know. I'm gonna try something different because I'm not doing too out of that stage. Oh yeah, I remember this one. I made it to this before. It's gonna take me some time to get back into this. Also, speaking of time, I don't have unlimited time today, so I have, I have about an hour. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Oh yeah, I forgot about this fucking thing. See, I don't, you know what, I don't like that weapon. Because it's like, it's kind of random where your shots are there. Shield, I like shields though. 
I wish I could always have shields. Can't shoot those things on top, apparently. It's odd to know like what you can hit and what you can't. If I keep moving, maybe I won't get shot by these crosshairs. That is one thing I think I remember about playing this is there's so much that I don't know what I can hit and what I can't hit. Oh my god. Like sometimes these ships in the background, it's a little hard to tell if they're in the background or the foreground. I mean, I guess it's just a little bit of playing the game enough to know. Don't you, don't you hate when that happens that you're playing a game you literally can't tell if something in the, is in the foreground or the background? It's like not super obvious. And then it ends up killing you because you're not sure. Well, I lost my shield, but at least I'm not dead. Jesus Christ. There we go. Now if I had that and a shield, all these games are always about keeping your keeping your items not dying oh shit oh my god like that Fuck. god can i go through that see see right there i didn't know if i could even do that but i can apparently guy again. Maybe it's in the back. Or maybe it's one of these things where there's no, like, exact point to hit him. It's just, like, hit anywhere. I have a feeling it might just be, like, hit anywhere. Because I don't see anything really flashing. Or you know what it is with this game? It's where the shit's exploding. Because I don't think... Mm, shit. Yeah, you know what? In, in the front there. See, that's the difference. It's not like one of these shooters where... Um, where something's flashing when you're hitting it. It's when you see that red explosion. That's when you know you're hitting it. So, so it's a little different. I'm, I'm remembering all this now. See, I, I know that there, that's hitting it. That, that's hitting it on top. It's basically this gun up top. I think I'm trying to just take it out. Come on. What would I do without this back laser? You know, this, the, the background reminds me of, honestly, that, that Bucky O'Hare stage with the spaceships going by and you have to, like, jump on them. The one I was having a really hard time with when we did the game on hard level. I don't know, is that, am I even doing anything or just, does this fucking thing just take a million hits? I've never played them, JTO, Mally. Do I 
to collect games for Atari. Yeah, I do. Yes, I do. Except I don't... There's only a few more I need. I've been collecting those for my whole life. So, they're all really expensive now. So, I don't know if I'll ever complete the collection. Hopefully. Oh, there! Finally, it fucking blew up. Finally. Wow, it just takes a ton of hits. Alright. Well, at least... Wow, I can't believe how many hits that Maybe I'm just not powerful enough that it just took... Maybe, maybe my gun is shit. I'm sure it is. God. I think that's what's going on here. I think my gun's a piece of shit. Please be that level. There we go. Stage three clear. See, you can do it out of order. All right. Now, now it randomly just takes you. Not randomly. It takes you to the next level that you chose. So this is. I don't know what stage this technically is, but for me, it's stage two. I like that they do that. They give you the option. It's nice. And again, you know, I was kind of. I like. I really like this game a lot. Um, this is honestly, this is probably one of my favorite, um, shooters that I've played, which is why, why uh, I mean, I can just tell, like, look at these fucking graphics. Like, if I, if I ever had a video game, like, this is what I would want it to look like. So also, um, let, let's let's hear a little like history on this game because I, I had I had an article up. It's just Wikipedia, but let's hear a little of this game's history. Thunder, ah, it's so far away. Hold up. Um, so Thunder Force Four, known in North America as Lightning Force, which is what we're doing here, um, is a shoot 'em up game developed by Technosoft for the Mega Drive in '92. It's the fourth installment of the, the Thunder Force series, and the third and final one created for the Mega Drive. Okay, it was developed by the Technosofts. They, oh, they did Devil's Crush. Um, maybe that's where I heard of that. Uh, including the vertical and parallax scrollings for illustrating the immersive env environments. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, Thunder Force 4 is a horizontal shoot em up. We know all that. I want to know about the other games. Da -da 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 -da. How about Thunder Force 3? That's, where is that, like, is there a thing on the whole fucking series? This is what I want to find. Let's find, let's, I'm looking up Thunder Force 3. I should really go to Thunder Force 1, but let's see, what was that on? That's on Sega Genesis, Super Nintendo, and Sega Saturn. I wonder if I have any of those. Let's look up Thunder Force 2. Thunder Force 2. Thunder Force 2 is for... Oh, you know what? I recognize that cover. I might have that. Uh, that one was for Sega Genesis and regular Thunder Force was for whoa, a lot of things. Um, wow. Uh, arcade, Mega Drive, Genesis, a lot of computer things. Super Nintendo. Sega Saturn, PlayStation, PS2. Oh, it was on 3DS as well. Okay. You know what I want to do? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a quick break super quick because I want to see if I can find any of the other Thunder Force games. I keep playing this one because when I played it... You know, what's, you know why? Because everybody... There was a lot of people that were recommending this one to me. Maybe, the other, maybe this is the best in the series because I guess this is the last one, I'm assuming. So maybe this is the best one and that's why so many people recommended it. But, um... But I want to see if I have the other ones, just for sake of argument. Let me see what uh, you guys are saying real quick. Um, da, 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 da. I think Thunder Force 3 is Lightning Force. Uh, it says Nero. I don't know. Um, yeah. 
you may have already known this, but your ship speed is at 75%, and in my opinion, 100% is better for most stages. Oh, I, I did know that at now at this point. Um, I was keeping it 75% because I didn't want to go too fast, but I might switch that. I'm just getting used to the game now, so. The first one for, was for the sharp, okay. Two is all right, but it had overhead stages, okay. So, see, Ikaruga Sil Silver Gun knows this stuff. That's the series, Mike, not Thunder Force 1. There's Thunder Spirits on SNES, Thunder Force 4. Mike, don't listen to me. <laughs> uh, 4 is apparently the best one because it had the best music, but 3 is awesome in the same way, but it's easier. Okay. Uh, thanks, Analogic Disturbance, for subbing. Appreciate that very much. And... Anarchy says this is one of his favorite Genesis games. Yeah, it's really good. All right, I'm going to take a quick break, super quick. Cause I just want to look around and just see if I do have any of the other Thunder Forces. I think I might have another one. I'll be right back in a minute. All right, so from looking very briefly, um, I don't think I do have any more of them, but I do have, I think I had streamed this before. This is Truxton. This is another one that I, that I found that, that I, I like that one a lot. The one that I have that I might have been thinking of uh, I have Space Mega Force because the other one, you know, Thunder, Thunder Force. So maybe I was thinking that. So I don't think I do have the other ones, unfortunately, which, which is too bad. Um, Thunder Force Three is Thunder Spirits on Super Nintendo. Oh shit. Um, hmm. Yeah, I should look and see if I have that. I won't do it right now though. Space Megaforce is related. Um, but anyway, regardless, people are saying that this that this one's the best one anyway, so. Oh, it's not the same developer, Megaforce, so yeah, never mind. Alright, anyhow, let's keep going with this. Sorry for the for, for the long break here. I'm just curious. I'm really I just really curious about this series. Um, what what maybe I should do is stream the the original arcade game. But um, for any of you guys that know, how is the original arcade game in comparison to this? Is it worth it? You know, fuck. Other than just like me being able to see the game, like is it? Like, is this better, basically? Jesus Christ, these things coming from behind. All right, I need to, like, do this here or something. Yeah, I should have been doing that. See, that's the kind of thing, when you know what's coming, you're better off. Mm. You're always better off if you know what's coming. Boom, 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 boom. If I get all the way to the top, what, what can they possibly do to me? Nothing. Fuck you. Looks like I was shooting batarangs. Oh, what with that? Or, no, you know what? No, I don't even have that weapon anymore. There was, there was an enemy down there that I didn't realize. <clears throat> I'll just continue for now. I started at the beginning of the stage, probably. Yeah, that's fine. I'll learn eventually. Look at these mountains. These mountains look awesome. shot, I guess. I know 
I should probably switch my speed. I'll switch it to faster. You know what? Fuck! this thing. Oh my god. Is that ever gonna... Jesus Christ. There it goes. That wasn't the boss, right? No. That was just some random shit. Oh god, we're going underwater. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. I, will those things kill me? Like, I don't even know. Those big little mines they left behind or something. I don't know if I got to this before. This game is very fucky O'Hare. I have, like, no fucking good weapons. With, like, the shooting stages. Like, near the end of Bucky O'Hare, there's kind of, like, a thing like this. Thank you very much. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Hack the Movies, for subbing with Twitch Prime. So that's Tony. Um, I'm going to be doing some streams with Tony. Um, maybe maybe tomorrow. And it's blowing me up. Either, uh, probably tomorrow. Fucker. This doesn't work. Either tomorrow or, uh, Thursday, I might be streaming with Tony on here. I'm not sure what we're gonna play, but play something. You would go as far as to say as. Batsu Gun was the best shooter ever at the time of its release. I thought Parodius, Sexy Parodius, was your favorite. Siphon Filter stream. <laughs> I like that even you know that Tony loves Siphon Filter. Uh, Power 10. It's like a joke. Um, it's not a joke, though. Oh, fuck. I just noticed a little fact, too. If you... If you change your speed, it does a little thing on the back of the ship. I don't know what it says there. See, that's another Star Fox thing to me. When I, when you get that, what does it say? It's like... Maybe I just can't understand video game voices. I don't know. It's, it's from playing too much NES Ghostbusters. I can't understand voices. Honestly, you know what? Even in like a lot of modern games, I can't understand what they're fucking saying. Where where their voices are better. Maybe that goes into why I'm not so into story. I can't understand what they're fucking saying. That's what it all sounds like to me. gets all the way over to me. I'm like, fuck, huh? The laser's gonna come out. Like... Boom, fuck you, thing. No, I'm just gonna die again. Consider this practice. Whoa. to start like beating some of these fucking games, I swear to god. All these shooters I'm playing, like I like shooters, but there have been not many of them. Fuck! 
There's been not many of them that I've actually beaten. I beat Nexar. Um, I'm trying to think what other shooters that I've beaten on stream. Um, not a lot. Uh, Gradius 5. I did Gradius 5. I did Nexar. I'm not really sure what else. There's, pro there's probably other ones, but not a lot. I haven't done R-Type yet. R-Type is fucking hard. The first Gradius? I beat the first Gradius on stream? I don't even remember streaming the first Gradius. Okay. You know, that's the thing. I do, I do so many streams, I don't even fucking remember. When am I doing R-Type 3? I didn't... Uh, I don't... Oh, wait. Didn't I beat R-Type 3? Uh, not R-Type 3. I mean, uh, Gradius 3? Gradius 3. Did I beat Gradius 3? I think I did, actually. Anybody remember? Oh, I didn't? I thought I did. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't beat it yet. I beat Truxton. Gradius 3 and 5. Oh, okay, so so Gradius 3 I did beat, but it was on it was on the easier mode. I okay. Gradius 5. Is Gradius 5 harder than Gradius 3? Um Well Gradius 3 in the arcade, fuck! Is like impossible, but it, you're talking about the Super Nintendo game. Um Well the thing is there's a lot of variables, especially with Gradius 5. Um, so, honestly, like, if you were to play Gradius 5 on, like, some of the much harder settings, probably, uh, maybe Gradius 5? Like, if you play on the real hard settings, but then again, Gradius 3. I, 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 you know what, I'm not, I am not, um, experienced enough, really, to answer that question. This is gonna be the answer I'm gonna give, because... Fuck, I haven't beaten them on the harder settings. I think you'd have to ask somebody who beat those games on on the hard settings. You know, I don't think I don't think I'm a good person to answer that question. Um, let's put it this way: they're both hard on the hard settings. <laughs> you know, it, this is just gonna kill me. I don't know what you do there. Maybe I have to get behind the fucking thing. I don't know. Damn it. I, I know Ikaruga I Silver Gun. I have it written down. I have it. Is Mike talking about the SNES port of Gradius 3? Yes, um, I was talking about the SNES port of Gradius 3 because I was only doing it on the easier setting. I, w I was talking about if you did it, if you did Gradius 3 on the hardest setting on the Super Nintendo game versus Gradius 5 on the hardest setting, um, I was saying I don't know the answer because I haven't done those games on the hardest setting. So somebody that has beaten those games on the hardest setting. Um, I, I, like, personally, I wouldn't include Gradius 3 for Arcade, because it's, like, I don't even know if that's fucking really possible to beat, because it's, like, fucking broken. So, yes, I was definitely talking about Gradius 3 Arcade. Shit.
try to get behind it. I don't know what to do with that fucking thing. I think I just have to have stronger weapons. I'm gonna start over. I know that I've got already beaten a level, but I don't know what to do with that. I think I need to just have, I just think I need stronger weapons. I'm gonna do that level again because I'm gonna put the air, you know what? I'm gonna put that air raid at, on the last because I haven't, I, like I've already beaten that one. So I feel like that's the best chance I have of beating one. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna do it like this. Like I need to get good at each thing. That aim, whoa, wait, that aiming laser won't hurt you. If you pass through it quickly, it'll fire the main wave and you'll pass through it. Oh shit, I didn't know that. Okay, no wonder I was having such a hard time with that. I thought it was just a fucking laser that would kill me immediately. Okay, that's a huge help. Thank you. Who said that? Vaden Krieg. Thank you so much. I didn't know that. Okay, that's a gigantic help. See, I would not have guessed that, because that just that just looked like a fucking laser beam shooting out to me, so. So yeah, I did not know. These guys, like, I guess you just hit him in the head, but, like, I haven't killed one yet. It's gonna come out again. <sighs> I don't think hitting him there does anything. You know, I'm gonna avoid the bottom of the screen there, because there's just too many things shooting at the bottom. Like, I feel like staying up higher on this whole part is probably doing me better. I'll go down just a little bit just to see what's going on down there. I'm like, oh, you know what? This guy's probably here now, huh? <sighs> All right, now I think I'll be able to get through this now that I know this information. Yeah, oh, there you go. It just, oh my God, it's so much easier now. Thank you. That was what I needed to know. That's what I needed. No wonder I was getting fucking repeatedly killed. exactly where to be on this. So I think I need to get around this. So can I go on the bottom or where do I get around in the back? Because this fucking thing does like a thing where it goes up in the corner and then I'm like fucked. So I don't, I want to, yeah, there you go. Like that. That's what I do. Okay. All right. So I got that part now. Whoa. It's like fucking sinking me into the water. Oh, this, okay, so it's still here. Oh, yeah, and here's the fucking arm. Which is like, I don't even know. Fuck. Can I be in the water? I wonder if I can be in the water. Let's see, I don't know. I don't know what to hit. I don't know what, I don't know what I'm doing here. Do I do I actually attack the arm? Is the arm what I'm going for? Let's see, I don't know what I'm supposed to hit. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Now it turned into this. Or, you know what? I bet that's just a, a thing I have to wait out, huh? Fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. I know what it is. It's this bubble thing, isn't it? You know what? I bet you. You know what? You, you probably do there. You probably kind of stay right in front of the bubble. I bet. Okay. I'm gonna do that stage again. Um. Now, now I'm getting us down a little bit more. Let's try this again. I'm, just, I'm 
getting better at it. I feel like that other stage I did, that like Bucky O'Hare looking stage, that was the easiest one, I think. Watch, I'll never be able to beat it again. The stage is a bitch, and I'm, I'm assuming that guy I was just on has to be the boss. My next method, I think, is gonna be to try to stay um, um, near the ball part and just. I'll just try to steer and stay near the balls. You know? It's probably the best method. I'm never gonna kill one of those. I don't even know if it's possible. stuff in this. It's, it's, this is probably where it's coming, right? Yeah. See, look at me getting through this now. Boom. It's so easy when you know what to do. Alright. Do I prefer top-down shooters or side-scrollers like this? Um... I like both of them, probably equally. Um, I feel like I might be better at the top-down ones. Um, like typically, I yeah, typically I feel like uh, I'm, I usually do better at those. I find I yeah, I find that these horizontal ones I'm not as good at for some reason. Um, but but as far as fuck, but as far as liking them, I think I like them equally. There's nothing. Like, I don't think you can hit anything here. And on this part, I just mm, need to get in the top left corner. Wish I could get more weapons. I should be going faster, too. Great! Fuck! Now this thing's gonna come out, and I'm gonna die. <laughs> but at least I can find out if that's where I need to be, I guess. Okay, doesn't it tra change into the guy here? Oh wait, not yet, it's the arm thing. I keep forgetting about the arm. I hate this arm, I hate this arm. Jesus Christ. stage will get you a homing weapon early on, so you go for that one first. Okay. Maybe I should do that level. Yeah, but that's like if you can keep it, <laughs> which there's no way I'm going to keep it. Will you... Well, I see you playing F-Zero The Revenge again. I can't wait for it, says it grew. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that again. I'll, also, I have a bunch of other F-Zero um, hacks. Um, I'm only going to do this rune stage first because somebody recommended it to me. So I'll see. Because they said there's a weapon that maybe I can use. I don't know. But you know what, though? It's stupid because... Like... I need to know where to be on that arm thing, and I don't know where to be, because it's just the arm comes out and I just fucking die. And it's not even so much because of the arm, but it's the arm combined with those, like, um, bu bullets, I don't even know what to call them, uh, explosion things <laughs> that come out, the projectiles, like those kind of things. On that part, they just all kind of spray out at the top of the ship, and it's just like a million of them come out, I'm just not sure. That, like, with these kind of games, there's specific placement. Like, you want to be in, in certain spots, and I just haven't figured out the spot to be on that, on that arm part, but... But eventually, maybe I'll figure it out. There's a lot of that in, like, Radius, too. It's like, you know, you find that things are impossible, but as soon as you figure out 
where exactly to be, then it's like, you know, then you can get through it. Kind of like every shooter ever made. <laughs> oh, you know what? There's like little dots in the background that I didn't, never noticed with the, the shit spawning. Fuck! Where was that I didn't see? With the shit spawning on top. Oh, look that. Like, see how they, how they're just like little teeny balls first? <laughs> Now I'm gonna get murdered for that statement. Oh, fuck! Man. I don't, I don't like this snake thing. I wanna, I'm gonna save that. Hunter, fuck this shit. Do I blow up the arms first? Hold up. I, I think I had to blow up the arms first. I didn't even see that. Like the front of it. That might have been the problem I was having. Oh, fuck. Dude, fucking hit the bottom of the screen. God damn it. <laughs> fucking shit. <sighs> Alright. Let's, I'm gonna do that again. God. Have I ever played Mass Effect? No. What's that on? I, I, mo I like. I mostly play retro games, so isn't that, that's like a more modern thing, right? I don't know. I don't really keep up with that stuff as much. <laughs> I almost said I don't keep up with that shit enough. But God damn it! Uh, I have to move the Sega Genesis closer. I'm gonna fucking kill myself. I don't know. What kind of game is Mass Effect? Is that like a fucking like Space Marine shit that I don't really like that much? Let me look it up. Let's see what that is. Science fiction, third person, yeah, is probably not. Mass Effect is a science fiction action role playing third person shooter, blah blah blah. Is it like a space marine thing? Let me see what that is. That would be like a 50 bar stream. Define Space Marine, in my mind. Um, like one of those, like Halo kind of thing, where you're just going around shooting like, like first person or sh third person where you're just like on a fucking planet, just like shooting aliens or you're shooting like other dudes. And it's just like all you're doing is shooting and hiding behind fucking boxes. Is it that kind of game? Is it, is it a lot of stealth hiding behind boxes? Is it that kind of thing? I don't like that. That's what I want to know. Because if it's not, then maybe I would like it. I mean, you probably wouldn't like it since it takes forever. Well, there's that too. It has that. Bo <laughs> boxes.
It's a lot of reading. You farm for items on planets. Okay. You hide behind boxes a lot, but you also have s spells. You know what I re re need to read is like, need to do is I need to look up footage of it. Is it one of these games that has like 18 million? Yeah, like Mass Effect 3. Let's look up that. I want to I wanna see, because cause the thing is, like, I didn't know whether or not I'd like Gears of War, and I didn't like the story mode of it, but I did end up liking the multiplayer thing, so, like, I don't know if there's, like, a multiplayer thing for this. Come on, baby, that's a Fuck, like, oh my god, Christmas ads. Go to Walmart and buy a fucking... Yeah, it is a Walmart commercial. Okay, let's see. Nice. Alright, somebody's like, let's play. Oh my god, yeah, it's totally like a dude in a Space Marine costume. A bunch of cutscenes. Yep. This is like exactly the kind of shit I don't like. Cutscene. Bad alien, like. Jumping around. Like, yeah. No, I'm not lying to that. Nope. That's the exact kind of games I don't, I'm like not into. Nope, I'm not doing that one. Shit. Nope, nope, nope. Wall warts. I like Spider-Man. That was good. You know, and, and by the way, there's, it's not like there's anything wrong with those games. They're totally fine. They're just not my type of game. It's just not something I would personally play, but there's nothing wrong with it at all. So I'm not saying that it's bad. I'm just saying it's not for me, just to be clear. So, like, if you play those games, that's totally fine. If you're into that, I'm not shitting on it. Like, the graphics look nice. It's just not my kind of game to play. I would get bored with that. I know what you're saying, we all have our preference in, in games. Yeah, it's just not my thing. I like um, when I play these kind of games with James. I always, I'm always like, like if we if I was playing this with James right now, I'd be like, hey James, what do you think the fuck? What do you think the fuck? What do you think that I probably would say that too? What do you think the story of uh, this game is? And, and James would say, <laughs> he would first of all he'd say the story, <laughs> and then, then he'd say, um, shoot shit. One second. Sorry. All right. Um, God damn it. Too many things. <sighs> Too many distractions, guys. Too many distractions. fucking thing. Yeah, you know what? Yes. It is blowing. Now I see it. It's blowing up the front of this fucking thing. I didn't see that before. First of all, now I see that. Yeah, see, that one's gone. Oh my god. Now that one's gone. Alright, so that's, that's phase one. 
powerful back shot, though. Alright, that's alright, that's alright. See, now I know what to do. One of my problems here is, like, I feel like knowing when you're shooting the enemies sometimes is not... It's, it's not that it's not clear... It's, it's that it's not as clear as it is in a game like, um, like R-Type or something. Because I feel like the enemy is, I, I just feel like it's a little bit more clear. Like this actually right here, where, that, that was flashing, but when it's more like you can tell by like the red blowing up, I find that to be a little bit harder to tell to me. Ooh, now we're on the next stage. We're living on the air in Cincinnati. Cincinnati, WKRP. Alright, so now this level. What the fuck was this level again? Oh, pff, fucking dead. Great. That's the. Oh, and that was the fucking. That was the thing I wanted. That was the whole reason I fucking did that other level first. God fucking damn it. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Now I'm pissed. This is the upgraded, like, forward shot thing. I'm staying away from the bottom. That'll just fucking kill me. Well, at least I got through that level. I think that was the first time I, I beat that. Fuck! That I beat that level. So at least there was that. Oh my god, this level is destroying me right now. After all the bitching about boring ass Game Boy Star Trek games he's playing, you'd think he'd be happy to. I can't read the whole chat. Everything's fucked up right now. After bitching about boring ass NES and Game Boy Star Trek games he has played, you'd think he would be happy to see a spiritual successor game that is more like Star Trek? What game are you talking about? Are you talking about me bitching about? The Game Boy Star Trek? I, li I like the Game Boy Star Trek. That's why I keep playing it. I mean, I might have been complaining about certain aspects of it, but, like, I actually, I like that game. Maybe he's just talking about somebody else. But the NES game, actually, yeah, the NES game, I, I didn't really like that much, from what I remember. I could, you know, I could play it again. Maybe I'd like it better if I played it again. But I remember when I played it years back for the AVGN video, I didn't, I definitely didn't really like that game. But yeah, the Game Boy game. I mean, the thing is, the Game Boy game is more of a shooter. It's stupid, I mean. But it's, I don't know, I can, for whatever reason, I kind of like it. I guess I just like it because it's like a side-scrolling game. Um, a, it's a side-scrolling horizontal shooter with the Starship Enterprise, and there's not like enough of that. So, so yeah. Let's not pretend. Try Mass Effect. It's like Star Trek. All the all the talking and action it's pretty good just picture Kirk or Riker <laughs> that's funny well when they replace it with Commander Riker hey uh, by the way we have a Commander Riker emote now um, yeah just probably not my thing but you know that's cool if that's more your thing. It's 
fuck. Can't get through it, I can't do it. Now, now we're arguing in the chat whether or not this Mass Effect game is like Star Trek or if it's not like Star Trek. How about this? Who cares? Let's talk about let's talk about Sega Genesis games since I'm playing a Sega Genesis game. Let's let's do that. I'm not playing a Star Trek game right now. I'm not playing Mass Effect. Let's talk say let's talk about Sega Genesis. That's what I would like to talk about. Let's change the subject. How about that? Here, here, are we all game on that or no? <laughs> game on! How about that Genesis TNG game? <laughs> no! No, not that! God. Has anybody played Ranger X on Genesis? Says Vaden Krieg. Yeah, Vader uh, Krieg. Is it Vader? Vaden Krieg. Um, I, ha I have that, actually. I want to pop that out real quick, because I have been thinking about playing that. How much time do I have left? Uh, oh, shit, not a lot. Um, I'm going to have to go soon, guys. But let me, um, really quick. W one second. I want to talk about the Ranger X. Okay, so I have Ranger X here, which is another thing I've been wanting to try. Um, I haven't, pl I've never played it yet. Uh, so it's engage in airborne combat with jump jets and weapons of incredible power, or link up with your cyber cycle for high-speed ground attacks. I'm trying to see. So I think you're in like mech suits, and I guess it's. I guess this is... Use jump jets to attack by air. Oh, maybe you're walking on the ground jumping. I'm not sure exactly. I've never... Like I said, I've never played it. Transform into super cyber cycle and roll to victory. Looks pretty... Looks like it might be pretty cool. Oh, let me switch this so you can actually see it. Ranger X. So, yeah, maybe... Maybe I'll try that. All right, I'm just going to play a little bit more of this. I need more time to really get, like practice this game, but no. Okay, top left, top left. All right, there we go. Ah, oh, that's like the, uh, an item, right? Fuck, I need to grab that too. And then it's gonna be, oh, then it's gonna be this part. This is where I'm gonna just fucking die. Oh my God, Jesus Christ, that almost killed me. It just swings and then I don't know. I don't know where to be. Um, maybe I'll try this one more time. Sink in the water. Can you really do that? I d I did notice that you can kind of go in the water without dying. I didn't know that you could actually, like, literally, legit, like, go in the water. Unless, unless the person is just, like, trolling me. I'll try that. This is gonna be my last try, because I, I have to... There's an important thing I must do.
life. But once that gun is off the fucking screen, I'll do this. Alright. FUCK! I wish that would just stay, even if you die on the speed that you had it on. It doesn't seem to, though. I'm gonna get killed before I even make it. Like... And you know what? I was thinking those, like, orange spinning light things. I was thinking I had to hit those, but I don't think that's the case at all. Fuck. Don't scratch your face even for a second. Oh my god, this fucking thing. I'm gonna die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mm! Oh, got it. Okay. I'm still gonna fucking die, but at least I got that. See, see this like thing that looks like a fucking cop? I'm gonna try this going in the water. See, right above me, right there, I kept thinking those things, those orange things there were like, you had to shoot those, but I don't think, I don't think those are anything. So, somebody was saying like go in the water. It seemed like that might be the deal. Oh my God, is this what you'd fucking do? Oh my god, this, I think this is what you do. Like, legit. Oh my god. No wonder I wasn't fucking getting through this. Holy shit, look at, look at that, look at that. Oh! Okay, now next thing. Yeah, no, 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 I can't do that. So, I have to figure out some other kind of pattern or something. <sighs> All right, I don't know how to do this guy yet, but at least I know that part. Let me, let me see something. Let me see if I have enough time to do this again. Thank you, just stay quiet. Just stay quiet. I think he made that username specifically. It's a it's about me. It's like just shut the fuck up, Mike. I I believe it. That's what I believe. Probably good advice for me. Just keep my just keep my mouth shut. Who wants me to do a silent stream? Should I do that? Shit. Fuck. Yes, I you don't want no. Wait. Oh fuck, I'm gonna die here. Oh, it was a good thing I happened to pause it right there. Um, 
that's impossible. Nope, not me. That would be funny. Um. Anyway, you uh, you guys will be able to see these um, full un unedited whoa streams later on on my channel. There's a link right now in the description on, on uh, YouTube. All right, here we go. Fuckers. Boom. my speed up, fucker. One second. Okay. Alright, so I, I think I actually might have some more time. Just check. for me here, but it should. I don't know how low you can go, but I don't think, I also don't think that really hurts this thing. I'm like really, I'm just gonna go down, let's just say. You, okay, so you can go all the way down. I was so worried about like just sinking and dying in this, but it just you can go all the way under the water. That's like the most helpful thing ever to know. When I originally came into this fight, I thought that I had to hit those like siren things, which is why I kept staying near the top. You know, I had no clue. All right, up! Oh, whoa! It comes out again! Fuck you, thing! All right, this is the part I gotta figure out. Like, can I like get on the back side of it or something? Shit. It's getting red. Okay, I don't know what's gonna happen. Oh my god. Oh my god, did I do it? Fuck! No! Alright, well that, you know what? That's the furthest I got on that. Oh, and that ball comes back? Shit. All right, well, I mean, I'm learning. Fuck, all right, let me see what you guys say. A quiet ASMR mic drawing stream might be clean. <laughs> up, Bobby Beretta. May his balls no longer be blue. Check out Monster Boy just came out. It's a Wonder Boy tribute. Oh, Monster Boy. It's Dick the Flame Guy, yeah. Uh, Gek 
Nico Kira says, have you played Bullet Hell shoot 'em ups? I played, um, I think this counts, Toho. Those are Bullet Hell. Um, I did one called, oh God, what was it called? Um, Next Machina, which I think is a Bullet Hell, which I actually really liked. I should play that again. I haven't played that in a really long time. Um, this is something... See, these shooters are things that if, if you take any time away from it, it's been a long time since I played it, that I completely forget everything. So I should come back to this really soon. <sighs> Cerebus says, this is Genesis title. I honestly don't remember. Thanks for playing. Yeah, uh, try this out. You lose the rhythm, yet it's not that even just that I lose the rhythm, it's I also lose what exact where to be and what to do. Would I ever do a video on the CRT monitors? Yeah, uh, so on Patreon, um, I do a lot of exclusive content. I've done several videos, I'm gonna be doing more, so I do, I do that stuff on there, and thanks to you guys um, who support me on there. But I usually do those kind of things on there, but um. Yeah. Um, or at least, no, I should say that they are, um, they are, you get to see them ahead of time. You'll eventually see them. Do I play on a 4K TV? Uh, if I'm playing something modern, like I was playing uh, Spider-Man on a 4K TV, but for this stuff, I play it on an old school. Thanks, Count Daro. All right, guys, I'm going to stop for now. Um, I'll try to stream later today again. Uh, again, try out this game, Lightning Force. It's really good, or Thunder Force 4. And uh, all right, thanks for watching, guys.